I will use this exercise to show how simple engineering principles can help in analyzing the requir required power to operate the dozer on sloped uh, uh, rough uh, surface. We know the dozer maker and model which can uh, we can retrieve its data sheet from the maker website. We are uh, looking for the operating weight of the dozer, which turns out to be 103,849 pounds. The dozer is pulled at an upward grade of 3%. The towing force was measured to be 6,060 pounds. So we need to calculate the rolling resistance of the road we are interested in the rolling resistance rate in pound per ton but we need to calculate first the absolute rolling resistance force let's start analyzing the dozer equilibrium by displaying the rolling resistance force FRR applied on its body diagram the towing force is also trying to overcome the grade resistance force FGR, uh, which is the grade component of the dozer weight. From equilibrium, we can state that the towing force FT equals FGR plus FRR. We are after FRR. We are giving the to given the towing force. What about FGRR? or FGR sorry we can calculate FGR by using its relation with the weight that we uh, derived in the lecture we insert the given values and uh, find FGR to equal 3115 pounds we go back to the towing force equilibrium equation and we are finally able to calculate FRR to be 2,945 pounds. The rolling resistance rate RR is basically the ratio between FRR and the machine weight W. which we find it to be 57 pound of rolling resistance force per each ton of weight. Lastly, we need to describe the road surface type, which we can do uh, with the RR value we just calculated. We have seen this RR guidance uh, table from the lecture we can locate the table part relevant to this exercise by focusing on the high pressure rubber uh, tire values we can match the RR calculated and given values and conclude uh, that the road is either a good asphalt or compacted maintained uh, earth <laughs>